Welcome to Chip Talk with your host, me, some guy from the internet. How's it going? How's your week been? Mm Mm-hmm. All right. Sounds good. I've had a fine week. It's Wednesday, hump day. We're almost there, folks. We're almost to the weekend. Um... Yeah, if you have one of those jobs where you get the weekend off, uh, maybe the weekend means nothing to you. If so, you know, I'm sorry. You know, enjoy your next day off. Or maybe you're an aristocrat that never does anything and you don't even know what a weekend is and you just sit around watching uh, chip review videos all day. Uh, if so, it's a, it's a system we've set up uh, where we work five days and then have off two days. Um, to live our lives. It's, it's not perfect. It's not a great system. But it's the only way that we can have chips. Chips like Zaps. Spicy Cajun Craw Taters. Uh, the only chip flavored like a disgusting creek-dwelling mud bug. Um, <laughs> I'll tell you this, the smell coming out of this bag is pretty good. Uh, last week's Zaps, the Voodoo, did not impress in that category. All right, looks like we got a nice kettle cooked chip. Or crisp, as you say, over in a jolly old England. If you're from England, I uh, want to offer my condolences. I hear you, you folks just lost a big game of kickball to some Italians. And uh, got very upset about it. Uh, so my, my advice to you, I would say, is to just relax and stop thinking about it. And, uh, you know. Maybe maybe grab a pint down at the pub um, and some crisps. Let's see what we got here. Crunchy. Good. You know, these videos are, I think, going to attract a couple different kinds of people. Uh, chip fans and uh, weirdos that like to listen to people's mouth sounds uh, on a microphone. And if you're a weirdo that likes to listen to people's disgusting mouth sounds on a microphone, welcome. Welcome. Welcome aboard, ladies. Yeah. That's Zaps. Spicy Cajun Craw Taters, and they are good. Yeah! Zaps, I knew you could do it. Um... I'd heard good things about Zaps chips, and the Voodoo left uh, not a bad taste. I would say no taste in my mouth. Uh, they just tasted like chips with some little bit of dusting of something on them. Uh, they they were fine, but they weren't like anything I would go out of my way to tell anybody about, except I made a big video about them. Um, these are good. I'm feeling that heat. That heat it creeps up. It creeps up like a like a crawdad in the uh, ankle deep flooded streets of Louisiana, uh, sneaking up to pinch you right above your right above the leather of your loafers, right on the ankle. 
These are good. Um, I've never tasted a crawdad before. They might be delicious. Um, they might be like little lobsters or something. Uh, but the the chips are good. I ex- I kind of I was hoping they wouldn't taste disgusting, like what I imagine a crawdad tastes like. Um, so that's Zaps Spicy Cajun Craw Taters. I would say go get yourself a bag if you have access to them. Um, and I'll tell you what, uh, uh, prime ribbon horseradish. Welcome to number two. Yeah, that's right. I'll say that Zaps Spicy Cajun Craw Taters have claimed the number one spot so far in my chip hierarchy of needs. Um, it's a close second, but uh, these these just these have a banging flavor. These slap. These chips slap. Um, so that's all I got for you today. You know, maybe I'll see you tomorrow or the next day for another episode of Chip Talk with your host, me, some guy from the internet. Until next time.